Well, schools across the country are talking about ways to protect themselves from threats, and some say that should include arming teachers. Thanks for joining us. I'm Rob McCartney. I'm Quinicia Fraser. An Iowa private school decided to arm teachers after the deadly shooting in Perry, Iowa. Well, now a Nebraska school is considering that. And investigative reporter Aaron Hegarty joins us with that and response from the state's teachers union. Aaron. Yeah, last week, Siouxland Christian School in Sioux City, Iowa, decided to, decided to arm some staff members, including teachers. Right now, that's not an option in, Nebra in Nebraska, but some support a bill in the legislature that would change that. At Lincoln Christian, they have physical protections, things like ballistic film and entryways to help protect against a shooting threat. We need a way, once they get through that, that we have the opportunity to defend ourselves, protect students, and protect our staff. But the superintendent says he'd like to see armed security too, and he says there's interest from teachers and staff. It's going to beat those people that, that have the aptitude and the ability and, and want to receive extensive training uh, to be put in this position. He says that's not possible now under Nebraska law, but he supports Senator Tom Brewer's proposal to change that. For some of our schools, particularly our rural schools, there's not a population of local law enforcement to draw on. The superintendent says they're also looking at mental health. We have a team that intentionally tries to dive into students that maybe feel like they're on the outside or that they don't have relationships. Because what we find in education and in, even in these acts of violence, relationships precede everything. The state teachers union opposes arming teachers and says most of its 25,000 educators are against it as well. Help our communities um, by making things safer, not creating more instances where there could be a problem. What we need is to arm ourselves with more resources, with more ability to help all kids to, to find out what's going on and to not answer with um, weapons. Other than allowing schools to arm staff, LB 1339 would allow off-duty officers to carry weapons onto school grounds and it would issue grant money to map schools for security reasons. The bill is yet to have a hearing. Back to you. Aaron, thanks.